Hi, welcome to my channel, Mala's Vegan Chick. I did a little vegan and alkaline grocery shopping today. Yes, picked up some goodies and I thought I'd share my haul with you before I put everything away. I tried to stay as close to Dr. Zabie's Cell Food Nutritional Guide as much as I could. Uh, I think pretty much everything that I did purchase, I do keep a guide um, in my kitchen. This is um, the guide that they send you. I just made a copy that they send you in the mail when you order a product. Um, so I just copied it in black and white. And I have sitting in my kitchen, so I always know and remind myself this is how I should be eating. <laughs> okay, so anyway, um, these are a few things I picked up from one store, and then all of this came from another store. So I just wanted to share with you things that you can find that are vegan as well as alkaline and are Dr. Sebi approved pretty much, like 99%. <laughs> okay, so. Um, these are a few things that I picked up from one store um, and then I ended up going to another store and got all of the rest of the things. Um, I picked up a bag of walnuts because I want to try a recipe that calls for um, walnut meat um, mixed with uh, mushrooms I believe. So I got a bag of those and I also picked up some fruit. I was in the mood to just have some fruit like immediately so as much as I don't like buying all the plastic the food in the plastic containers I went ahead and bought these two there's some cantaloupe and just some regular um, melon I don't know what you call this melon honeydew that's what it is honeydew melon so picked up a pack of these hopefully they'll be good um, so yeah I got some melon from that particular store and then um, the bulk of my grocery haul I got from Deerberg's yes they're very vegan friendly um, it almost felt like Whole Foods in there they have a lot of good stuff all right so let me show you what I got okay let me move this bag out of the way okay so from Deerberg's the first thing I got was some yerba mate tea um then there's the health benefits okay yeah Alrighty. so yeah you get 25 bags and this is organic okay so i got some tea got another box of tea i got the raspberry leaf organic tea um this is really great when it's that time of the month and you have cramps that's pretty much the reason why I got it <laughs> and you see there it says supports healthy menstruation tones the uterus and may be used for mental menstrual cramps so awesome and the only ingredient this is organic um, I believe the only ingredient is organic raspberry leaf so but I try those two. I've never had those two before. So I got that. And then I picked up, let's see, some organic black mission figs. You know, figs are super nutritious for you. Um, these are organic. Um, I try to have figs like every day. Um, I heard they're especially good for you if you have any. Um, uterine fibroid issues they're really good for that to take every day so got a bag of those also picked up some quinoa always gotta have that quinoa um, and this is just um, plain quinoa and say the ingredient only ingredient is quinoa my camera's not focusing but yeah and that's what it looks like. So I got some quinoa. Also picked up these. I've been wanting to try these so bad. I finally found them. So I got the Eden Organic Pasta Kamut Spirals. So yeah, I want to try these in a pasta dish. And it does say the only ingredient is organic whole grain Kamut wheat. Okay. 
Um, it is kind of high in carbs. You know, it is a little bit high. So it's not something I would have all the time. But I like that it is made from the ancient grain Kamut. Okay. So I got a box of those. And then I picked up some Hep Milk. Omega 3 plus 6. And does have some you know other ingredients in it besides just you know being what it is so I don't really like some of these ingredients but I've been wanting to try het milk so this is all they had um, I don't know maybe I won't get this kind next time um, but yeah so I got some hemp hemp not hemp hemp milk and then I got a couple of packages of blueberries, or not blueberries, blackberries. Blackberries. Okay. Alright, so I got that. And then um, this other bag, I got more produce, pretty much just produce. Okay, so this is called a fennel. I believe it's the fennel bulb or plant and it is very alkaline very nutritious I believe it is high in iron calcium vitamin C potassium so many um, so I think what I'm gonna do with this is just chop it up and put it in a salad and it's also good for soups I've never had it in a soup but if you see it in your grocery store you have to give it a try so then I picked up, you know, just some Roma or plum tomatoes, a couple of those. Got some sliced mushrooms, a uh, pack of those. Always can use mushrooms. All this plastic, so bad. Then I picked up a lot of ginger because I have a recipe coming up that I'm going to do a video for. And it is going to be ginger root tea. Um, I'm going to make it in like a syrup form. And then use that to make tea throughout the, the week or the month. Or however long it lasts. But yeah, so I got a nice, you know, bundle of fresh ginger root. Okay. And then also picked up some mangoes. Yeah, just a couple of mangoes that I got. All right. All right. So down to last bag here. All the goody good stuffs in here. <laughs> All right. So I did. This was some water, just spring water. I picked up. I was going to drink this on my way home, and I forgot and put it in my bag. So I forgot I had it. But this is just Mountain Valley spring water. Really, really good spring water. Whenever I see it in a store, I always grab it. But I already had some, so I just grabbed that one to drink now and then oh, okay. Okay. also got a jar of coconut oil because I was out this is a beauty staple I rarely cook with it I mostly use it as you know a moisturizer for my body let's see where's the label um, it is organic unrefined cold pressed virgin coconut oil so that's what you want to get. So I got some of that. So all the stuff in here is in glass. That's why it's wrapped up so nicely. So I also got, I believe this is my juice. It'll be hard to do with one hand. <laughs> all right, so I got um, one of my favorite apple juices. This is the Lakewood Organic. Um, it's not the same one I usually get. I've tried this one before and it's pretty good as well. Um, but what I like about this one when I can find it is it doesn't have, you know, really anything in it but organic apples, um, apple juice and puree uh, from Whole Ripe Organic Apples. So I really like that. You know, it's not that concentrated crap. Cold press, not from concentrate yes so i just got a bottle of that and then i also got 
And I got some olive oil. You know, always need olive oil. So I got some of that. <laughs> it is virgin, extra virgin and cold pressed. So you definitely want to make sure that it's at least done. All right, so the last thing that I got is my favorite thing that I got. And it may not be 100% <laughs> Sabi approved, but it's close. And I actually found elderberry juice, not from concentrate. So here's a little information. Um, it's how much in there. I think you can actually take this and put it in some hot water and use it as a tea. But um, yeah, this is pretty good. Um, pretty good stuff. I've been wanting to try anything with elderberry juice in it. I've been wanting to try. So this is River Hills Harvest brand. And it does come in a glass bottle. Great stuff. Especially for the winter, you know, because elderberry is supposed to be very medicinal for cold, flu, um, any of that type of stuff. So yes, this is my favorite thing that I got at the grocery store. All right, so anyway, that is all of the good things. I think my granddaughter took off with my tomatoes. They were right here. I think she grabbed them, but... Um, Anyway, here's all the things that I got. So I hope you enjoy my little haul. It's a little salad I got back there that I'm about to eat. <laughs> all right, so that's it. Stay tuned. More videos to come. Definitely going to be doing that ginger syrup um, today. So that video may be up tomorrow morning or late tonight. So thanks again for watching. Stay tuned. More videos to come.